Hey everyone. So I got this question on my Instagram regarding uh, one of the YouTube videos that I posted switching out these headers on this car. Um, I did notice that there was a little bit of a torque loss when you started driving the car from like a complete standstill or like engine idle. And that actually really felt kind of disappointing because, you know, especially when you spend a couple hundred dollars on, you know, a new exhaust system or a part of an exhaust system, you would expect to have better performance, right? <clears throat> and a lot of people tend to think of um, horsepower as the only gain that you can get from, from changing out parts, like bolt-on parts like that. And horsepower, you know, <laughs> It's not the whole story. It's a, uh, you want low end torque to get the car rolling. And with larger primaries, those are the exhaust tubes that come right out of the heads of the, the engine. With larger exhaust primaries, you're gonna be reducing the initial exhaust velocity. How that can be felt is a reduction in torque, initial torque on lower RPMs. And so for a while, I was scratching my head thinking, man, I just spent like, you know, $700, $800 on these exhaust headers. And, you know, every time I press the pedal from, from you know, stoplight, it feels like it takes forever for the engine to kind of get more power until you're in the kind of like mid-range, right? And so that, that was a problem. And, and I was like, I don't know if I really want to keep these headers because with the stock ECU tune, it doesn't feel right. It doesn't feel as good as the stock um, exhaust manifold with the stock tune. Um, you're not getting that torque, right? So what I did was I started, I was like thinking like, oh, I got to go get in like a new tune, like something that's, you know, made just for my exhaust and my setup and everything. But luckily I had an e-tune that I had already purchased, you know, years back when I first got this car from Throttle Happy. It's it's known as an off-the-shelf tune or a generic tune. I call it a stage one tune. It's a better tune than the stock tune. It's a little bit more aggressive, especially at throttle tip-in. That's when you just start to press on the, the gas, like, you know, right at the, the first, you know, 10%. And what that did, that aggressiveness at, at tip-in was able to compensate for the larger primaries of the exhaust header. And so I've been pretty happy with how the exhaust is with that tune. And so I just wanted to give everyone a, like an update. Um, if you do get headers or you modify your exhaust specifically, you may want to consider getting a tune to compensate for any kind of weird drivability issues that might have come up from that. And uh, it helped compensate for the headers that I put on, which are uh, Inferno Fabrications 4 to 1 equal length low profile uh, headers. So hope that explains some things. Be aware when you guys change your headers, like you're gonna you're gonna get that torque loss, especially if the primaries are a lot larger than the stock exhaust manifold. So good luck with your uh, builds. Catch me outside, how about that? <laughs>